good afternoon to you all and uh, welcome to this uh, a live interaction session and uh, i express my sincere gratitude to this organizers to provide me this opportunity to share my thoughts uh, with you all uh, for this uh, uh, facebook uh, live interaction uh, session i am professor shrinivas i work for national institute of educational planning and administration the government of india ministry of hrd our institution at located in delhi uh, the the theme of the session is precisely uh, is is the need of the hour and we all know about this pandemic and uh, the kind of uh, practical situations we have been watching outside so at this current juncture and uh, our classes are uh, stopped lockdown extended you know all this sort of things so my my important uh, question in this case is so how do we start engaging our learners and uh, is it is it uh, uh, what was the easiest and best way and ultimately you all know very well that the teacher plays a major role as far as this uh, teaching learning is concerned so it is our job to sensitize to motivate and engage and orient our teachers to build their competencies so that uh, whatever they could able to do they can do it much uh, easily and comfortable way and uh, the uh, that that is that is one of the important uh, thing which uh, we want to do it uh, on 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 a on uh, this uh, time and uh, the next important thing which i just want to say it here is uh, uh, how do we uh, how do we do it uh, all, all these things so is it is it easy or is it difficult or Now, what what sort of things can be done with uh, the, the 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 with the teachers, and uh, and you all know very well that uh, you know whether it's a conventional classroom teaching, whether it is an online teaching, the teacher plays a major major role. So the question in this case is how do we uh, how do we take uh, the teacher into confidence, and what all the things need to be done uh, with the teachers. That's what my focus of my uh, presentation is uh, all about. Uh, so the title of my presentation, which I have planned to do it, is on uh, building the competencies of teachers for the online teaching. So uh, let me start with a positive note of uh, uh, Albert Einstein, who says, "I quote." Uh, i do not teach anyone uh, and i only provide the environment uh, uh, they can learn i think that is aptly uh, works in this uh, area and because what is important online teaching is not like simply providing some reading material some videos or interacting through uh, the the system but it's it's a completely ecosystem it's a total new ecosystem with or with with the proper training uh, and uh, has to happen so the the point which i try to drive it here is uh, the environment matters that is very very important to so albert einstein ne jo baat kaha tha wo bahut bahut uh, important hai uh, aaj aaj ki uh, context mein and uh, the next important thing what i am uh, trying to say that we know very well that it is it is uh, it, it it is easy and it is implementable uh, but what is important is how do we start how do we start and uh, how do we go about it and uh, then what are the things uh, which constitute that you all know very well that uh, one of the famous quote of alvin toffler about the 21st century is uh, Uh, as a quote uh, the literate of the 21st century will not be those who cannot read write and uh, but uh, those who cannot learn unlearn 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 and relearn 
it's okay uh, so <coughs> so what is what is important uh, at, at, at this uh, in this uh, context is uh, whatever you have learned is okay but when 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 uh, when you are teaching in a online teaching learning environment uh, with a with a total uh, diversified uh, 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 students uh, so so how do we meet their expectations so you constantly has to learn and of course you need to do the unlearning and relearning and this has this has to happen on a on 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 a, on a regular on a regular basis and uh, <clears throat> the next important uh, thing because to do it all these things uh, one thing is very very important is uh, the change management as you know uh, one of the famous book of uh, dr spencer johnson uh, who talks about uh, the uh, the change and the change management and it this book titled uh, who moved by cheese uh, he says very uh, very correctly a uh, change happens you know uh, whether whether we like it or not corona has uh, at least we revisited this online teaching uh, um, uh, paradigm and other otherwise generally we are all conventional classroom based teachers and we are all very comfortable we are very good teachers that there's no doubt about it बट ये पैंडमिक ने हमें ये सिखाया कि ऐसे ऐसे माहौल में हमें क्या करना चाहिए तो हमें स्पेंसर जॉनसन ये बात हमेशा ये कहता है कि एंटिसपेट द चेंज मॉनिटर द चेंज एडाप्ट द चेंज क्विकली चेंज एंड एंजॉय द चेंज बी रेडी टू चेंज वेरी क्विकली दैट इज दैट इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट ऑफ दैट and uh, those of you are uh, interested to uh, see the further readings of uh, and and i have i have prepared a small uh, uh, site of mine uh, which is uh, professor k shrinivas dot a few in, uh, small information i wish to share uh, about this particular site this site was designed developed and delivered using a free open source uh, applications <coughs> and uh, uh, this site i have been using for my own teaching learning processes uh, the process is pretty simple and that's what i just want to make it uh, and before that i i, I narrate about uh, this site uh, let me tell you a small in, uh, information about a small definition rather the current day technology is an enabler the current day technology is a facilitator no doubt about it but the human being uh, in my case it's teacher the teacher is more important okay so without the teacher nothing is going to happen teacher is indispensable whether it's a conventional classroom teaching whether it's an online class it's not only delivery delivery i i i i i'm not talking about that and and uh, the teacher has to give the different directions and all so what happens uh, uh, what i generally how i use it i i believe in flip mode of teaching and uh, whatever uh, the concept which i am going to teach in my class i will provide the reading material well in advance and uh, i ensure that students read those reading material and uh, <clears throat> and, and have a uh, collaborative uh, of course i also set up a small uh, collaborative learning environment before the class uh, after reading through the reading material and and also test little bit of testing was also done so why i have been doing that so teaching learning process you know very well it's 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 a bidirectional process it's not a one way communication so what happened with the help of uh, this uh, orientation so that you can also join and uh, so once with this kind of a preparation when you come to the class and when you go to the class so naturally your class will be totally different so in the pre covid that was the scenario which uh, like you i am also following the same way and uh, during the covid also i think this is this is one of the easiest thing the only difference is the live interaction platforms like uh, it could be zoom it could be webex or it could be google meet we are extensively using the uh, google meet and and of course the uh, other uh, platforms like the facebook live and many other things so what i'm trying to say that um, it is a cost effective it is easy to use 
it is easy to implement without much it's almost uh, the the uh, experience is flat the technical exposure which i've been talking talking about is completely flat uh, which can be implemented that's what uh, i think every one of you can also do it a little bit of uh, knowledge is little bit required otherwise you can do it so the need of the hour so in need of the hour hai kya iska so let's make use of this lockdown period as an opportunity and relevant to the present situation abhi ka jo mahol hai is mahol ko ek opportunity samajhna chahiye and relevant to the current situation sabse aham baat main ye ek baat kehna chahta hu engage the students continuously by interacting with them through the online or any convenient form suitable for them and and the students what is important uh, at this current juncture is uh, uh, how do we engage the learners what is what is more important for me is engagement of the learners is very important and you had to uh, you had to do it in such a way uh, that uh, they 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 can, they can use it comfortably and without any difficulty also uh, they can they can able to use it okay the second uh, the last important point which i uh, wish to say in this case is uh, adapt to the change uh, and, and and very importantly when 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 the teacher was not adapted when the teacher was reluctant to um, accept this kind of a changes what happens in this case is it may not be it may not be that much fruitful uh, to get convinced uh, we, we can we, we cannot uh, uh, convince to get by the others so first of all convincing uh, by the teacher is very important then afterwards then the process can start uh, working on that okay so 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 what is what is important uh, in the current context is it's a time to adapt the change uh, to be relevant since the technology of online education and the the digital initiatives have the uh, possibilities to revolutionize the um, higher education friends okay the then what was the need of the hour the need of the hour is uh, in one uh, corner you have an outreach the second corner you have a continuity and the third corner you have an equity so all these things has to be ensured that was so what was the change uh, which uh, you could able to see it here so in a traditional uh, conventional classroom teaching uh, the role of a teacher is a sage on the stage Uh, so generally teachers we all of us are doing the similar way and uh, of course uh, we have a paper and paper has some objectives and outcomes and uh, very importantly we'll give a lecture as per the our schedule kind of a thing of course we give some homework as such uh, what was the change which i've been talking about which i just referred before to you is uh, let's let's uh, don't don't continue the similar method yes of course some of them are continuing that but still i am giving you my own perspective of doing that uh, let's let's make the class is an activity based is truly but but uh, you know provide the reading material provide the interaction well in advance and try to see that whether they could able to uh, use it uh, uh, in a manner which could be acceptable for us so what happened in this case then we will be allowing the students to stand on their uh, on their own and and you will be facilitating that okay and let's let's think it over uh, this thing and one of the important component of uh, the building the competencies of online teacher uh, teaching is the resources so we need to build the competencies of the teachers hame hamare sathiyon ke sath to ye karna padega ki resources kahan kahan available hai किस फॉर्म में अवेलेबल है और वो जो सारे रिसोर्सेस को अपने क्लासरूम तक ले जाने के लिए हमें क्या करना पड़ेगा और आप सबको पता है कि भारत सरकार ने 2017 में स्वयं नाम के एक मुक्स प्रोग्राम लेके आया उसमें विद्यार्थियों के लिए भी कोर्सेस है हमारे टीचरों के लिए भी है सो वट आई एम ट्राइंग टू से दैट येस देर आर गुड क्वालिटी आर खैव कंटेंट एंड इज अवेलेबल दैट कुड बी यूज एज ए रीडिंग मटीरियल इन यूर कोर्स and of course uh, second one is swayam prabha india's first free dta channel where that could be used and national digital library that is one of the wonderful area where that process can be done epg patshala yes uh, that's again uh, one of the best uh, uh, e resources platform which is available and open educational resources when we are talking about 5th july 2020 and first and foremost thing and let's let's try to explore the available resources and try to map those resources to your classroom teaching 
and as per your course plan lesson plan uh, objectives and outcomes if you find the relevant material is not available then only think of uh, uh, going for uh, uh, generation of the new resources okay and uh, the 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 action plan of course there there are around five to six points are there which i just want to uh, share it with you and the first and foremost action plan is continue from where you have stopped so uh, so that is the one of the important competency that is moving towards the online that's what that's what uh, we the teachers has to understand uh, providing the reading material in video format and uh, other 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 material also even though uh, if you are comfortably and our students are comfortable with uh, email and whatsapp kind of a thing yes you can able to do that and uh, provide oer links to the learners for the further study okay excellent oer material open educational resource material is available and and uh, that is the need of the hour which one should you and develop a video lecture on your own for example if as per the lesson plan or ob uh, objectives and outcome we find that uh, the material which is uh, uh, for example it's not available in the vernacular languages it is not available in hindi तो आपको आपको आराम से एक छोटा छोटा सा वीडियो दस दस मिनट का दो दो वीडियो तीन तीन वीडियो बनाने की कोशिश कर लीजिएगा उसके लिए तो जो कॉम्पिटेंसी डेवलप करना है वो करना बहुत जरूरी है एंड असाइनमेंट्स इस इसके बारे में भी काफी बड़ा चर्चा चल रहा है कि असाइनमेंट्स को कैसे देना है असाइनमेंट्स को क्यों कैसे करना है एंड एक्सलेंट एंड इफ यू आर यूजिंग ए लर्निंग मैनेजमेंट सिस्टम विच आई जस्ट थ्रू सम लाइट ऑन दैट वन एंड द फर्दर स्लाइड्स so you could do that so all these are competencies so uh, moving from the conventional classroom to the online teaching and uh, searching the reading material and well making the reading material available to the students and uh, searching the oer content aligning for your class and developing the content as per the requirements and uh, and giving the assignments these are all the competencies that teacher has to develop and uh, so that he can move comfortably into that Uh, for the last uh, almost uh, almost three and a half months, uh, almost daily, uh, when I am interacting with uh, of my learned colleagues across India, either in webinars or in uh, uh, this hands-on workshops, and uh, six uh, to seven important queries uh, that teachers are asking, I thought uh, maybe uh, I'll 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 flag those things in the beginning of my presentation. that would be very much helpful here so what are the questions they have asked the question number 1 is uh, what type of hardware exposure is needed for online teaching this is the first question people are asking the second important question what the people have been saying that uh, uh, what is uh, this live interaction platforms like zoom meet jitsi webex go to meeting microsoft uh, teams are they enough for online teaching okay and i'll come back to this uh, possible answers uh, in after few minutes and uh, the third important uh, question uh, the the teachers are asking what is the need of this learning management systems like moodle or google classroom and are they enough for the online teacher and uh, the next important uh, question would be do the teachers need to prepare the videos uh, and the e text if said yes if it, if yes then how and uh, question number 5 is uh, how do the faculty conduct the assessment assessment is again a big big issue and uh, the last but not the least what methodology of teaching uh, to be adopted for the online teaching before answering this questions uh, these are all the general queries uh, our learned colleagues are asking me Uh, whenever i start i try to answer those things uh, either the beginning or the middle or the end uh, but before that i always used to say something like you know we uh, this is this is an unprecedented pandemic we are all facing in this country and across the world and academics and <clears throat> are also not an exception so at this current st uh, situation and what we could able to see this online teaching could be a possibility so that we can engage the learners with a structure 
we can follow with a structure we can follow with such a procedure so what the one of the and what please try to understand that uh, uh, we have to you have to make up your mind for this online teaching without doing that it will be very difficult to do it okay so the first uh, question as I, as i read earlier uh the answer for this question is what type of hardware exposure is needed for online teaching and you know simple uh, like uh, how do handle the laptop how do we handle the desktops how do we handle the mobile phone and how do we ensure that webcam is should be off webcam should be on microphone should be on microphone should be off you know these are all the uh, knowledge you know a hands on exposure what is important is many times you must have seen that in uh, in workshops we have been telling people uh, you know don't speak together just wait for uh, give 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 chance to others to speak and uh, maintain the decency you know suddenly i am not saying that they are not uh, decent they are very good people absolutely no doubt about it but what is happening is uh, we don't know that how the functioning of the uh, the, um, the device is being affected Uh, so so the hands on exposure of uh, the hardware is very much essential now so one of uh, that is the one of the important dot in online teaching very important the second important dot in the online teaching is live interaction platforms isme zoom hai google meet hai jitsi hai webex hai और उसके सवाल ये था कि सर इससे तो ये इसी इसी को समझते हैं ऑनलाइन टीचिंग नहीं आई सेड वन ऑफ द कंपोनेंट ऑफ द ऑनलाइन टीचिंग इज दिस क्यों ऐसा क्यों क्योंकि जब ये पैंडेमिक सिचुएशन आ गया था जब ये लॉकडाउन अनाउंस हो गया था इस दौरान हमें लाइट एट द एंड ऑफ द टनल ये दिखाई दिया कि जूम जूम के नाम से सो एवरीबडी सेंग जूम 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 जिस Zoom is one of the important component of uh, uh, of the live interaction platform, but it's not everything. But what is important is when we uh, just imagine the scenario how we have been teaching in a in a traditional classroom. We go to the class, we give a lecture, then of course we interact with the students, we pose the questions, then afterwards we are providing some links. and some notes also we will be exchanging to the students and those things would be prerequisite for the next class similarly because suddenly when this uh, when when uh, this corona problem has come so we the classes were started the, the teach some of the teachers started engaging the learners <coughs> so with the help of this uh, live interaction platforms there are many uh, not only one so what is the basic advantage of this uh, platform it supports the classroom like scenario that is one of the important thing and uh, the third uh, question which uh, some of the faculty members are asking me uh, what is the need of this learning management system and um, what this learning management system does and is it enough for the online teaching and the role of the learning management system first of all uh, there are uh, there are there are uh, the google classroom is one of the learning management system moodle is again a free open source learning management system uh, yes there uh, that, that also plays one of the important dot in the online teaching which which needs to be connected with the uh, live platforms as well as the exposure uh, so uh, the every teacher this is one of the important competency of the uh, of the teachers so that you know if you want to offer a course online if you want to teach online what is important uh, is <clears throat> Uh, how do we first of all we need to understand the uh, nitty gritties of this uh, learning management system and we can start working on that so what what all it covers basically in, in a nutshell i should say that it supports the self study mode it promotes the learners to learn on their own pace space and time it supports the collaborative learning it supports the device independence uh, so that what happened with the help of this uh, <coughs> the learning management systems what the teachers can uh, what the students can do and uh, they can they can uh, it supports the very important component is a self study mode of course uh, uh, fully supported by the teacher concept and of course the peers also and it promotes the learners to learn on their pace space and time 
very very important uh, activity like all the learners are not equal there are slow learners there are average learners average learning learners there are gifted learners you know all these factors would definitely <coughs> but but learning is happening but there everyone does this on their own pace space and time and uh, a very important uh, factor would be it supports the collaborative learning which is very important uh, point and also it supports the device independence they can able to access from any device which is uh, uh, very very uh, the, the student can able to access without any difficulty as such and uh, so the next important question people are asking about that how the teachers uh, need to do the teachers need to prepare the videos and you can read that means that teachers are already having some awareness about yes <coughs> <coughs> whatever the content which is going to be placed it should be placed uh, in in the digital format and in videos and decanting but before answering that question i must say that teacher is very very important for the online teaching and uh, it is our responsibility uh, we should strengthen our teachers uh, we should orient and we should provide the good quality inputs and and friends i must tell you something you we need to we need to support to each other at this uh, at this current uh, pandemic situation uh, so that so that you know uh, we we should learn from our mistakes and we if you have some best practices try to share with us it, and, and you know so that uh, uh, the teaching learning process uh, and uh, can continue and we can start engaging our learners much much effectively coming to the uh, video and uh, text e text preparation uh, but i uh, first of all i am i am not in favor of uh, uh, content preparation in the first instance why because uh, uh, every every teacher must be having a course plan every teacher must be having a lesson plan and every paper must be having you know very well that objectives and outcome so what i am trying to say as per the lesson plan first and foremost thing try to see that government of india e resources if any useful content can be available from our e resources uh, like swayam we have excellent platform swayam prabha we have national digital library we have a huge huge collection of good quality material epg patshala another excellent uh, uh facility by I, i'm just quoting few because of the paucity of the time and uh, these things uh, are available first and foremost thing and plus uh, quality open educational uh, resource content is available so pehle hame ye karna chahiye tha ki jo existing apne uh, lesson plan uh, ke mutabik objectives and outcomes of ke mutabik पहले जो एग्जिस्टिंग कंटेंट को ढूंढने की कोशिश कर लीजिएगा और उस कंटेंट को अपने क्लासरूम तक पहले मैप करना है एंड इफ द सूटेबल मटेरियल इज नॉट अवेलेबल अपने लेसन प्लान कोर्स प्लान के मुताबिक मटेरियल अवेलेबल नहीं है then then yes definitely you create the content using simple टूल्स अगेन अगेन आई डोंट वॉन्ट टू क्रिएट टू मच फर्स अबाउट द the tools kaun sa badhiya hai kaun sa sahi are all which, whichever the way you are comfortable with okay screen castify simple screen castify tool is available screen castomatic is again obs studio is a simple tool audacity for the audio free cam there are there are so many uh, tools are available nowadays friends i think i i i, I request you to spend at least a half an hour time on your own and and so that you know you can you can learn it, it i think all this uh, tools which i just mentioned here uh, they are the simple tools and uh, these tools can uh, you can you can create a good quality uh, content uh, uh, without much uh, difficulty as such and not only content creation and also the content dissemination skill also the teachers has to learn okay and uh, many times we we uh, we create the content and again the content dissemination is one of the important uh, factor and uh, because i am bringing the concept of the youtube here okay so so uh, when when we are talking about the content dissemination and uh, very importantly uh, because you had to put the uh, content in your in your youtube own channel 
first and foremost thing um, initially to begin with how to search the content how to curate the content how to filter out the content this this small small uh, um, uh, you know uh, competencies the teachers has to develop and once you create your own video how to put the video into that what kind of privacy options can be selected you know all these things again what i'm trying to say that it, it it's it's a sunk uh, circle so that you had to start from somewhere and then then we'll continue to do that and it's it everything requires uh, two important things conceptual understanding and uh, technical knowledge okay and the next important question what the faculty members used to ask me about the assessments yes this learning management systems have an excellent assessment options like moodle has a huge huge uh, assessment methods are available similarly with the uh, google classroom you can you can create uh, wonderful options are available and uh, yeah let's 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 uh, start with a moderate way of uh, using simple uh, multiple choice uh, quiz kind of a thing and even though uh, multiple choice quiz is a formative assessment method uh, but i can i can say that uh, let's let's make use of that in such a way that uh, uh, put some uh, very few knowledge level questions and give more emphasis on the application level questions analytical kind of a questions and critical thinking kind of a questions uh, because it requires a effort driven um, process sari cheez so aap isko aaram se aap kar sakte ho matlab knowledge level ka questions kam de dijiyega application analytical or critical thinking ka questions zyada de dijiyega aapko to kafi acha ye ye kaam aayega ऐसा ही जैसे हमारे असाइनमेंट ऑप्शन है ओ एंड बहुत सारे देन ओपन बुक एग्जामिनेशन भी अच्छा खासा आप कर सकते हो ऑल दिस थिंग्स आर पॉसिबल सो व्हाट इज इम्पॉर्टेंट इज यू हैव टू कम अप विथ ए इनोवेटिव आइडिया एंड ए क्रिएटिव आइडिया अदरवाइज जैसे हमारे ट्रेडिशनल क्लासरूम में होता था ऐसा ही होना चाहिए थोड़ा मुश्किल है क्योंकि करंट सिचुएशन में बात ये है कि बच्चे अपने घरों पे हैं एंड टीचर्स आर आर एट होम एंड वी आर मेंटेनिंग द सोशल डिस्टेंस एंड मेनी थिंग्स आर सो सो व्हाट एवर द बेस्ट वे मतलब को वो गुणवत्ता बनाने के लिए और छोटे छोटे नवाचार भी हो सकता है उन सारे चीज़ों के लाने की कोशिश करना चाहिए एंड द मेथडोलॉजी विच आई ऑलरेडी मैंशन टू यून दैट वन आई थिंक वन ऑफ द बेस्ट वन विच यू कैन से दैट वी कैन फ्लिप द क्लास and also uh, one of the the four quadrant approach is very much available for us and these two things can can go simultaneously okay and uh, so so what is uh, important uh, if if i want to say about the competencies for the online teaching and uh, first and foremost thing uh, if if i if i want to summarize it it's a subject matter expertise is very important Uh, whatever the subject experts you have it you should be a deeper understanding on that uh, second important uh, point uh, which i wish to draw your attention is course planning and organization if you want to teach in online apart from the hardware live uh, interactive platforms and other things you need to plan it and you need to plan the course and the organization of the course and uh, the third important uh, factor is about the hands on knowledge on software and hardware whatever related things so so what we are going to do and how do we go about it and those those things are, are very much the need of the hour verbal and non verbal presentation skills plays a major role uh, collaborative uh, and the teamwork uh, questioning strategies involving students and uh, coordinating these activities Uh, these are all some of the, the you know competencies uh, every every teacher must be having uh, before moving on to that one okay so uh, if 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 i am looking uh, for the what was the road map uh, for this online teaching let me uh, let me try to um, you know highlight uh, some of the important uh, points for the road map for the online teaching as uh, as i already mentioned to you the first important uh, point is we need to set up our mind towards the online teaching friends very very important if you are if you are not uh, set up our mind it will be very difficult and very importantly aapka jo natija jo hai na sahi nahi sahi nahi aayega sabse important wali baat hai aur dusra important step ye hai ki kuch broad decisions aapko lena hi lena hai 
और ब्रॉड डिसीजन में से पहला ब्रॉड डिसीजन है कि जैसे ये लर्निंग मैनेजमेंट सिस्टम्स हैं जैसे मूडल है या गूगल क्लासरूम है कि सेल्फ स्टडी के लिए किसको अपनाना है और किस कितना परसेंटेज कंटेंट उसके अंदर देना है क्या कौन कौन सा कंटेंट बाहर हमने जो सिंक्रोनस प्लेटफॉर्म्स है जैसे जूम है मीट है जिट्सी है गो टू मीटिंग है या या कोई भी इवन फेसबुक लाइव आल्सो तो क्या क्या चीज़ आप करना चाहते हो सबसे इम्पोर्टेंट इसके ऊपर तो काफ़ी क्लैरिटी uh, होना बहुत ज़रूरी है एंड सेकेंड नेक्स्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट क्लैरिटी इज अबाउट द पेडोलॉजी तो पेडोलॉजी में uh, मतलब फ्लिप मोड पढ़ाना है और मुक्स की जो फोर क्वाड्रेंट अप्रोच है वीडियो ट्यूटोरियल्स ई कंटेंट असेसमेंट एंड डिस्कशन फॉरम दैट इज अगेन एंड कमिंग टू द असेसमेंट्स आल्सो हम टीचर रिव्यूड असेसमेंट्स देना चाहते हैं पेयर रिव्यूड असेसमेंट्स देना चाहते हैं आटो ग्रेडेड असेसमेंट्स देना चाहते हैं इसके बारे में पहले से ही तय करना है पहले से ही डिज़ाइन करना है तभी आपके यही इसलिए मैं बार बार ये सारे चीज़ों को फ्लैग करने की मैं कोशिश कर रहा हूँ और उसके बाद जो सबसे बड़ा इशू ये है कि रोल ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स एंड टीचर्स सो टीचर्स क्या टीचर का क्या रोल रहेगा स्टूडेंट्स का क्या रोल रहेगा क्योंकि कन्वेंशनल क्लासरूम टीचिंग में यस वहाँ वो चुप भी बैठ सकते हैं बट ऑनलाइन में चुप बैठने से तो कुछ कुछ निकलेगा तो नहीं इट शुड इट शुड फैसिलिटेट्स द टू वे कम्युनिकेशन दैट इज़ वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फैक्टर ऑन दैट एंड वॉट टाइप ऑफ एन इंट्रैक्शन लेवल्स एंड फीडबैक मैकेनिज्म यू वॉन्ट टू सेटअप that is again uh, very importantly has to be thought of okay now coming back to the the learning management system as said for example whatever the learning management system you have selected you are going to select that and first and foremost thing have a thorough understanding of that matlab maan lijiye hum moodle ko select karenge ya google classroom ko select karenge aur koi bhi even uh, simple google sites ko bhi leke apne content ko deliver karna karna chahte hain kar sakte hain बट सबसे बड़ा मसला ये था कि आप पहले मूडल को जानने की कोशिश करिए मूडल करता क्या है मूडल के अंदर क्या क्या काबिलियत है एंड मूडल को किस तरीके से हम यूज कर सकते हैं ऑल दिस थिंग शुड बी अंडरस्टैंडेबल फर्स्ट एज ए ऑलरेडी मैंशन दैट कंटेंट प्लेस ए मेजर रोल एज फार एज दिस ऑनलाइन टीचिंग इज कंसर्न सो वेदर यू आर क्रिएटिंग दो द कॉम्पिटेंसीज ऑफ क्रिएटिंग द कंटेंट असेंबलिंग द कंटेंट एंड ऑफकोर्स इफ नीडेड द क्रिएटिंग द कंटेंट नीड टू बी डन एन वीडियो लेक्चर्स ई टेक्स ऑडियो मटीरियल इमेज मटीरियल वन इम्पॉर्टेंट थिंग इज वेन यू आर यूजिंग एनी एनी आउटसाइडर मटीरियल ऑलवेज विदाउट विदाउट फॉर्गेटिंग प्लीज मैंशन द सोर्स एंड and uh, give the reference give them attribute if needed uh, uh, send a polite mail saying that uh, i am going to use it could you please allow it yes if they have uh, allowed it don't worry about that you can make you can use it but even even after using also try to always never forget to mention about the uh, source uh, and uh, mention about the uh, reference material as well as the uh, as well as attribute to them it it's a creative work Uh, please try to understand that so so it is our responsibility to try to see that uh, whether this applies for all the video lectures all the e text material audio material image image type of a material and uh, now coming to the the next two important factors that you know of course uh, the, the lot of people have already doing uh, this this work and uh, uh, they have an expertise i think create a group of people and we learn from our mistakes addressing the issues and concerns strengths are very important so that what need to be done and where we went wrong and uh, you know uh, after the after the thorough in, uh, introspection what we can do is we can review it we can fine tune it we can uh, move ahead uh, um, uh, as 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 per the planning as such so what is important to me is all these things are very important and uh, and we should uh, so so what i'm trying to say whatever i have been mentioned uh, now i think every teacher must be having a, 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 must be having a, uh this this kind of a competencies need to build uh, whether you attend a webinar whether you attend a, a hands on training program uh, what is important is how much time we spent on ourselves that is more important for us and uh, try there are now uh, thanks to this uh, corona it has it has given a many many opportunities for us to learn 
so one such uh, option which is already available for us is uh, the digital initiatives of government of india which i have already mentioned uh, something about swayam india's first moocs platform where courses are available for the faculty and courses are available for the students and uh, swayam prabha is india's first uh, dth 32 channel uh, free dth channel where good quality uh, archival content and good quality live content is available so what is important this could be part of our life when you are offering an online course resources are very 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 important good quality resources it's not only simply having a and and of course all this all these things will come uh, uh, in 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 a, in a nutshell so but what is important is good quality resources and uh, these are are plays a major major part of it the third digital resource of government of india is national digital library as i already mentioned again a huge good collection of content is available different subject areas different author based available so so i think we need to spend some good quality time to uh, use those material into the class and the last one is of course ebg pathshala this is again one of the um, good uh, e resource uh, the government of india made it available for us that the teaching community so it's it's very important and we should start uh, are uh, using this one uh, okay the few more uh, things because since we have been talking about the online teaching and online courses what no, what is not an online course i just want to say let me quote uh, by saying a online course is not simply a traditional face to face course replicated on a computer screen that's very clear in this regard so they have certain course goals and they have certain learning outcomes uh, since uh, of course we have certain part of it is uh, face to face can be implemented but most of the time the students are doing the self study the students are using in the in the in the in that learning uh, process what is important for me is uh, uh, we can we can uh, spend some good good quality time to do the needful and uh, and and, uh, and uh, that can be that can be worked out in a much comfortable and better manner and uh, so so communi computer communication and feedback are highly important and which should be which should be executed uh, uh you know uh, uh, and uh, what is uh, what is what is in, what is important uh, in this in this context friends which i which i just want to what which i just want to say very very clearly here uh, so communication and feedback are highly important and it should be structured accordingly that's that's very important point of it uh now coming to the uh, what are the instructional design issues we should thought of i think before doing that and uh, you know again i've been telling that uh, we, we when we all joined the teaching profession one thing was uh, told clearly by our head of the department uh, teaching is an art and teaching is a science and teaching is for you need to plan your class and uh, similarly in online also you had to plan your class accordingly and uh, you know uh, like uh, it, it it should it should be instructor led and uh, student centered that is one of the important uh, uh, point of that and as uh, the the next important uh, thing is it should support the collaborative nature of uh, uh, and um, collaborative nature of that and uh, the next uh, next important thing is you know all students are not equal we know very well uh, by this time and what is important is uh, that uh, student pacing every student uh, pacing uh, uh, is different so we had to we had to cater to that and uh, of course uh, the course uh, should foster the information communication technologies collaboration and team building skills because the tools which are facilitating in uh, in this can can have uh, all the all these things are built into that i think uh, that's that's how we need to make use of that and uh, it, it 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 could it can it can work much uh, <coughs> effectively and the course format expectations and instructions should be clear and concise please try to understand that uh, we always uh, say that uh, you know it it should be understandable 
but it, it, it but you need you need to work on that you need to work on that in, in online there is a small thumb rule is uh, never assume okay and uh, that's how we we need to do that one and activities and assessments uh, should accord for the different learning styles these are all the things uh, should be keep in mind uh, while uh, while designing uh, a, a online course and online classroom as such um, so that is one of the important uh, thing the next important i wish to flag uh, quickly is uh, like like i said no the instructional design uh, things uh, there is there is an ecosystem like in our conventional classroom also we need to we need to think uh, uh, in a different way uh, similarly in our uh, an online classroom also uh, there is an ecosystem and uh, the ecosystem consisting of uh, designing the course the ecosystem consisting of one of, one of the important component is uh, content development the delivery of transaction how do we engage well, the effective and best practices to engage uh, encourage and motivate the learners and uh, how do we create the uh, good quality assessments and very very important is the discussion forum which is a collaborative learning environment where uh, uh, where where the teachers uh, where the doubts of the students will be answered in the uh, near real time basis uh, you know what all these are these are all the factors which uh, which uh, matters a lot while doing with the online courses and uh, you know there is uh, in my side there is one interesting uh, checklist for designing the online courses available i i think if you find time please go through that and uh, access the uske andar kya cheez hai kyunki ab kisi bhi kisi bhi एक कोर्स को डिज़ाइन करने करेंगे तो बहुत सारे इश्यूज को हम पहले मान के चलते हैं तो उस उसमें पहले सबसे इम्पॉर्टेंट है ओवरऑल प्लानिंग इज इम्पॉर्टेंट एंड प्लानिंग फॉर इम्प्लीमेंटेशन इज आल्सो वेरी मच इम्पॉर्टेंट सो वाइल डिज़ाइनिंग द कोर्स मतलब कुछ इश्यूज को मैं जरा फ्लैग करने की आपका कोशिश कर देता हूँ आपके सामने आ, ये कोर्स आप वीक वाइज पढ़ाना चाहते हो या टॉपिक वाइज पढ़ाना चाहते हो और इसका स्टार्ट डेट एंड एंड डेट क्या है और दैट मीन्स इट इज इट इज अ शेड्यूल कोर्स एंड एंड इट इज सेल्फ बेस्ड कोर्स एंड कंटेंट कितना परसेंटेज कंटेंट को डेवलप करना है कितना परसेंटेज एग्जिस्टिंग कंटेंट को यूज करना है उसके पास हमारे पास स्ट्रेटजीज क्या रहेगा और कौन सा डिलीवरी प्लेटफॉर्म को चुनना है क्योंकि आप आप सबको पता है गूगल क्लास रूम इज अगेन ए गुड लर्निंग मैनेजमेंट सिस्टम ऑफकोर्स मोडल इज अटेस्टेड फॉर सो मेनी ईयर्स so what is important is if you are using something and you cannot straight away jump into uh, that learning management system you need some preparation that you need to understand the nitty gritties of the system and how do we go about it and as per the requirements you have to and course transaction is again uh, very very important because uh, what what content has to go and uh, as per every teacher has to deliver the content to the best of the ability many times what happened uh, because because of the uh, different uh, methodologies and we need to make the uh, adjustments that is possible with the online courses assessment preparation are we talk and you know which assessment you are using and when you are in the beginning of the beginning of the week and uh, or, or sorry at the end of uh, first week you are there what type of assessment you are going to give and how do we connect with them so we can it, it it shows to us it's not only assessment and there is an interaction option also available in the name of uh, a discussion forum so it is overall picture it's not only uh, and kai kai log mujhe poochte hain ki sir gunvatta kis cheez pe hona gunvatta mat design pe hona chahiye gunvatta content uh, development gunvatta delivery mein gunvatta transaction mein gunvatta assessments banane mein gunvatta discussion forum ko taiyar karke discussion forum ko apne uh, students tak le jane mein aur sabse important uh, masla ye hai ki how do we motivate wait and encourage and engagement of the learner and communication is very important it's again it's a new to them and please try to understand that aap aisa mat sochna ki ye to aaram se ho ho jane wali cheez hai aisa matlab ye easy hai ye 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 and and also if if you are not planned properly it also troubles you but i can tell you something it's not a rocket science it's not a rocket science 
okay and uh, what is important is you because since you have enough time uh, at home you can plan it uh, so thoroughly and uh, so so that you know you can you can do much much better um, as far as i already i have already told you that as far as the video content is concerned yes uh, one of the source could be your own resources and uh, second important source is about the open educational resources availability and government of india ka goi initiative se similarly same same thing can be done with the text material also as far as the the course delivery platform is concerned yes google classroom is one of the easiest one which can be implemented many of the teachers are doing that i'm very happy to share with you all yes many of them are using moodle also because you know what happened uh, normal uh, kind of uh, things uh, you know very few things can be implemented uh, you know sometimes if you want to have a some creative assessment some innovative assessment and kind of things it's and moodle is available uh, in two platforms uh, it's it's free uh, moodle cloud uh, is uh, offering for 45 days uh, option and uh, similarly uh, moodle uh, genomio.com is also offering uh, a, a sites free of cost i think uh, the kind of service these people are doing even though they are having small small uh, advertisements is very commendable because at this current juncture and it is you need a platform you need an environment they are providing free of cost so what is required for us is since there is an environment there are resources are made it available by the government of india and uh, and the trainings are being provided now it's time to uh, start uh, uh, putting the things into the practice uh, when it when it comes to the whether whether it's a moodle platform whether it's a google classroom platform Uh, the, the almost the mod modus operandi will remain the same uh, you need to add uh, the course content then we need to create the uh, to uh, creating the users and assigning to the course and of course content uploading as per the lesson plan objectives and outcome announcements very important uh, announcements we can do very uh, and moodle has more announcements methods but is yes, google uh, classroom is also having good and um, assessments yes uh, moodle has a wide wide uh, range of an uh, um, starting from the auto graded to the peer review there are so many <coughs> formative assessment summative assessment peer assessment there are so many assessment methods are available even google classroom is also having a good quality what i'm trying to say that we need not look too much about uh, which is one which is bad but but it's what is important for me let's start and and all these competencies and uh, need teachers has to start building uh, now uh, so that uh, they they could able to use these things in a much easily and comfortable way and uh, the two more competencies which uh, i wish to say for the next 5 uh, you know, minutes is about uh, uh, extensive utile, uh, usage of this cloud storage options like uh, uh, google drive or one drive or dropbox whichever way you are comfortable uh, why it is saying so because uh, i think stop using the uh, your uh, computer internal memory like uh, c drive d drive e drive and uh, desktop you know uh, because now we are and some content must have been there at your uh, official office or university laptops and desktops so so what is what competencies we need to develop is how do we access it how do we connect uh, offline how do we create a folder how do we upload the fo uh, files and uh, and uh, once we have uploaded some content there how do we ensure the collaborative working and uh, then how how do we do this uh, uh, content dissemination uh, what happened <coughs> you you put the content into one place in your drive and that can be connected with your learning management system uh, so that uh, whenever there is a change you can do it on only one place <coughs> and uh, and uh, you know it it gets reflected when the students refresh that page and very importantly uh, content dissemination content updation on the move when you are moving on and uh, you can you can use it from your mobile phones you can use it from the ipad you know whichever the uh, standard hardware devices are there that can be used and very importantly the safety and security of the data is ensured and you know so so that you know that can be and device independence is also 
provides so this is one of the important competency even though it looks uh, simple uh, but it's very 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 important because the kind of space this uh, learning management platforms are giving is very uh, limited so so we need to optimize the space one of the important technique which we need to learn is how to optimize it and uh, so that you know the um, the effectiveness can be brain brought into that and this next uh, very important uh, competency of the teachers uh, is uh, about uh, the hands on knowledge on uh, uh, google tools uh, like uh, how do we effectively use the uh, google doc and slide and uh, you know um, sheets and google forms uh, because you know right now what happened all these things you you try to understand these the nice simple effective videos are available and um, if if you visit uh, uh, iit bombay and it has got a very good uh, spoken tutorial material is available and if you visit our youtube itself just that's what i've been saying that spend some half an hour for yourself that is very important and 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 it is the need of the hour many times the people used to ask me that questions tomorrow whatever you have been learning uh, how can we use it when tomorrow the corona uh, right now you know this kind of pandemic it it, it taught us it taught us uh, you know how can we use it at the same time at the same time please try to understand one thing very importantly the uh, technology is an enabler technology is a facilitator no doubt about it but the human being who manages the technology is is very very much important to me and we need to sensitize that the, the human being as a teacher you need to orient them you need to provide the hands on exposure to them and and give them the environment they can work and so that they can work creatively they can work innovatively and uh, why have i been saying uh, this one on on repeatedly because ultimately whether it's a conventional classroom teaching is an online teaching uh, uh, we we are we are looking for a professionally competent teachers okay and 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 these things you know we need not get panic it's it's not a single day it can learn when when we have a thorough conviction jab hamare hum to sochenge bhai hame karna hi karna hai to aaram se kar sakte hai isme koi yahi baar baar main ye baat dohrane ki koshish kar raha hu ye koi rocket science nahi hai ये आराम से आप इम्प्लीमेंट कर सकते हो इसमें इसमें कोई ऐसा कुछ करने की कोई जरूरत नहीं है कोई नौबत नहीं पड़ता बट बट सबसे इम्पोर्टेंट वाली बात क्या है कि जब ये सारे चीज़ों को इम्प्लीमेंट कर तो पहले एक बार सोचो कि पहले पहले तो ए, ए, एक हफ्ते हम कैसे पढ़ाएंगे एक हफ्ते के कोर्स पढ़ाने के लिए हमारे पास क्या क्या सहूलियत अवेलेबल है और किस चीज़ों को लेके हम आगे बढ़ेंगे किस चीज़ों को लेके एंड एंड यू यू कैन डू दैट ऑल दिस थिंग्स आर नीड ऑफ दी अवर फ्रेंड्स प्लीज ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड एंड व्हेन 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 इफ इफ यू डोंट थिंक दैट इट इज इट इट इज डिफिकल्ट टू एंगेज एंड यू कैनॉट मेक ए स्टेप माई रिक्वेस्ट टू ऑल ऑफ यू इज जस्ट मेक ए सिंपल स्टेप्स सो सो जस्ट एक बार तय करके चलना है कि भाई हम करके करेंगे इसमें कोई इतना कोई दिक्कत वाली बात नहीं होते अब देखिए एक साइड में कंटेंट है एक साइड में स्टूडेंट वेरी इंपॉर्टेंटली अब स्टूडेंट्स के साथ भी मिल के चलना बट आज के तारीख में हमारे देश में बच्चे इतने अच्छे हैं और और आप आप जिस तरीके से उनको समझाने की कोशिश करेंगे वो आपके साथ चलने के लिए तैयार है तो बस आपको ये तय करना है कि भाई हाउ डू आई स्टार्ट डूइंग इट yes uh, and uh, many of the uh, i i i completely agree with you that there are issues are there in the future there are issues are there in the current and there are issues are there will will also be there in 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 future also but what is important to me is how do i make a sincere effort so that i can start engaging uh, my my own learners and uh, this again brings me back uh, to the the point where i started in the in the in the beginning uh, which i said the need of the hour again i i want to reiterate uh, the three points which i said in the beginning the point number 1 let's make use of this lockdown period as an opportunity and relevant to the present situation ye sabse badhiya opportunity hamare samne hai aur और इसको हम हाथ से जाने नहीं देंगे नंबर टू हमारा काम ही पढ़ाना है नंबर टू एंगेज द स्टूडेंट्स कंटिन्यूसली बाय इंटरैक्टिंग विद देम 
थ्रू ऑनलाइन और एनी कन्वीनियंट फॉर्म मान लीजिए आपको गूगल क्लासरूम और ये मोडल करने में थोड़ा दिक्कत है आप जो भी ऑप्शन आपको लगता है कि स्टूडेंट्स के साथ एंगेज करने में आप जरूर एंगेज कर लीजिएगा और तीसरा इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट मैं आपको बार बार ये बात कह रहा था इट्स टाइम टू अडॉप्ट चेंज बस अब अब वक्त आ गया इसको अडॉप्ट करने का तो धीरे धीरे करेंगे मतलब ऐसा ऐसा मत सोचिएगा ये कोई बड़ा बोझ है ये ऐसा कुछ चीज है ये कुछ नहीं इट इज नॉट ए रॉकेट साइंस अगेन आई एम टेलिंग यू अब इतने सालों से पढ़ा के आ रहे अब थोड़ा बहुत उसको टेक्नोलॉजी का टच भी दे के देख लीजिएगा आप खुद आप महसूस करोगे इतना बढ़िया रहेगा and uh, and and it's adapted the change to be relevant since the technology of online education and all the digital initiatives uh, that has possibilities to revolutionize the online education and uh, before summing up uh, i just want to say a famous quote of uh, uh, the um, the former president of uh, this great nation uh, apj abdul kalam saab ka kalam saab teen zabardast baatein hamesha kehte the the फर्स्ट वन इज फेल एफ ए आई एल तो हम नॉर्मली फेल समझते हैं बट फेल का मतलब है कलाम साहब की जबान से फर्स्ट अटेम्प्ट इन लर्निंग ए ई एन डी ई एन डी एंड इट्स नॉट एन एंड इट्स एफर्ट नेवर डाइस एन वो नो इज नेक्स्ट अपॉर्चुनिटी इट्स नॉट ए टिपिकल नो एंड इफ यू कैन स्टार्ट विद लर्निंग ऑल दीज थिंग्स विद ए पॉजिटिव नोट and this positive frame of mind and 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 decide to do that yes you can see that again revise uh, uh, revise once again what uh, albert einstein has said and you need to provide the environment where the students can learn and you can become your role as a facilitator and to be available with your students thank you very much for uh, giving me this opportunity and to to uh, put my thoughts in front of your friends Thank you very much. Bye bye.